Hello guys, good day. I'm back again for another tutorial. This is HBT tutorial for your basic tutorial and installation of BG and under open source applications. Okay, so for today's tutorial is I will teach you on how to make a campaign. Basic campaign for now. Okay, so let's start. So you need to log into your administration and then you can go to campaign so this is a test campaign that we created before so just go to campaign so you can test come you can put this campaign one okay so from here as of now we will set to default so for user group you can set to admin uh, next call agent it's up to you if you want to set random or longest wait so it means uh, for the longest wait meaning it will uh, if the agent uh, taking uh, too long to get in call or take time okay so you can set the or all this call start or jira, jira you can set or few calls wait time or few calls uh, okay so for best result you can choose longest wait and you can set what your dialing time for your campaign so for now we can set to 24 hours if you are calling 24 hours okay uh, okay then submit okay so upon submission uh, this campaign is uh, set to manual dialing only so if you want to set for deep deep or uh, and set to auto dialer so you can set this one to ratio and then you can submit okay and then you have now a predictive dialing campaign so and then uh, dial status so this dial status uh, this status only that will be called or will be placed on hooper to be called okay so you can add another status like answering machine so that if you reset the leads it will redial again the answering machine status okay like answering machine or etc et if you want to add more uh, dial status under the campaign okay so next one also need to be set up is the list order so uh, list order this one is down it means the down count of the call okay or down count of the number of call counts for leads okay so you can set if you want to set it to random second it means they will dial random leads and then uh, if you have new leads on another list they will insert the new leads over there okay so call count target at least three Per day, okay. So, for minimum hooper, you can adjust this one if you hooper labor. No, I think that's fine. This one hooper labor, uh, you can adjust this one. It depends how many uh, dialable leads you have. Uh, for minimum, you can set to 500 for the startup. Okay. So as of now, that's the basic settings that can teach you about the dialing a uh, predictive auto dialing campaign this one is only predictive if you want to enable the uh, on this campaign if you want to enable the inbound call also you can set this one to uh, yes so we will tackle this one for the, our next video for now this is uh, how to configure your basic campaign for predictive dialing okay so this will be good and you can set the prefix dial prefix it uh, defense uh, what's the configuration you set 
on your carrier dial plan so manual per pix also or if you want this one if you want to set yes you will omit the country code or the phone code the call okay so we will tackle also the custom caller id cid groups uh, routing extensions so uh, you can check all the details over here about the routing extension okay 8368 is the normal uh, predictive dialing routing extension okay and then after that you can use 8366 so this one is used for press one broadcasting and other so you can select or find over here so okay so hope you are enjoying our video for today about creating a basic campaign okay and i think this is big uh this is the end of our video hope you are uh enjoying it so you can continue uh the video for uh we can continue the configuration and settings on the next video okay thank you guys and have a nice day and don't forget to like and share this video and if you're not yet a subscriber you can click the notification bell or you can click the subscribe button and click the notification bell so that you're always updated on our latest video okay guys thank you and bye bye